know something, ladies and gentlemen? I hate atheists just as about as much as I hate Muslims, even more. Now, when I say I hate a sinner, I don't mean the person because I love everybody. I hate the sin, not the person. This atheist had the nerve to come on my channel and say that uh, God did not write the Bible. That Bible was that the Bible was written by man. And then in the same sentence, in the same sentence, he says that he acknowledges that Christian persecution is happening, but he believes that America is uh, is enacting laws to regulate Christian uh, Christianity. Something about people imposing the faith on others. So I said a couple of things, but he also said that that he didn't that. That's so he's saying that some that he believes that some people are being persecuted for their Christian faith to the you know that to the extreme, but while most Christians are not, even though that, that they're being persecuted mildly. Now this person didn't make any sense. So I wonder if this person even has a brain stem. Okay. I said to this person, I said, so you say that the Bible is written by man, right? This is what I said to him. I said, so if the Bible was written by man. Then why was Christian persecution prophesied and predicted over 2,000 years ago that it was going to happen in the future and it's happening now? I said to this person, so if the Bible was written by man, how can it be possible that these prophets, these righteous prophets of old, would know about something like this? How can they possibly know about Christian persecution happening so far in the future? How could they possibly know that? The Bible prophesied that Christian persecution was going to happen. Over that, it, it the Bible was written before Christian persecution even happened. Okay, the Bible prophesied Christian persecution was going to happen over two thousand years ago. So it was written before it even happened. The prophets of old in the Bible, the righteous prophets, predicted that the per Christian persecution was going to happen in the future. So Christian, so the Bible's written by man. How did these righteous prophets of old know that Christian persecution was going to happen? I said, what did they do? Guess it? Are you going to say that they guessed it? I said, that's impossible. They can't guess something like that. The only way that they could have known is if a higher power revealed that to them, meaning Jesus Christ, who is God, thereby proving that the Bible is written by Jesus Christ, not man, that God is the author of truth and that God used righteous prophets of old as vessels to write his word and then i said on top of that i said so so you say that you you believe that america should regulate how people practice their faith christian faith so i said to this person so are, are you saying that uh americans do not have a right to practice their religious faith christian faith i'm not going to advocate for the false faiths I said, um, the Constitution says that they do have a right. So are you opposing that right? I said, so you're not only arrogant and stupid. I mean, I'm going to be honest, but you're hypocritical. In one breath, you're saying that, uh, I said to this person, I said, one breath, you're saying that America should regulate how, people, how Christians impose their faith on others, right? And... And how people, um, how America should regulate that and how uh, America has rights. And in the other breath, you're saying, you're basically saying that uh, Christians, you know, shouldn't practice their faith. It's what the person's saying. I say, you don't make any sense. America should regulate how, how the faith is being practiced. But the Constitution says that every human being has a right to worship freely and practice their faith. Now, if you choose to practice a false faith, that's your choice. But the true faith is God. I said, how does that make sense? Guess what, ladies and gentlemen? This atheist didn't even respond. So atheism has been debunked in other five in under five minutes. These atheists, let me tell you something, ladies and gentlemen. They trust what the government says. They trust what science says. When science has been so wrong so many times, science can't even explain why the rivers are turning blood red. They can't explain the massive animal deaths. That's Bible prophecy. And also, do you know that global warming is a hoax? That's all over the mainstream media news. Even other atheists have exposed global warming as being a hoax. 
You know what that does to the credibility of science and man's knowledge? It seriously undermines it. So don't sit here and tell me that God did not write the Bible. So you're going to sit there and say something, you better have proof to back it up. And it better not be man's knowledge, because I'm not going to go for that. Don't sit there and say, um, man made uh, the planet. How do you know? That's what I ask these atheists. These atheists come at me and they say they have scientific proof. Well, how do you know that proof is reliable? How do you know the source is reliable? How do you know the Big Bang Theory happened? How do you know evolution happened? Do you seriously think that people uh, evolved from cells and apes? That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. The Big Bang Theory? Can you possibly sit there and tell me that stars blowing up is going to make planets? That sounds stupid. Michael Jackson, before he died, made a video saying that uh, the history books are a lie. Everything you know is a lie. And he's right. I'm not promoting him as a prophet of God because he was a Muslim. But he was right about that. The elites influence everything. They create history, they rewrite it as they see fit, just like they do with science. And they're not going to tell you people that. So you atheists obviously don't have a brain, you don't have brain cells, and you definitely don't have a brain stem. So the next time you come at me, you better have proof to back it up. When you sit there and say that God didn't write the Bible, when I know he did, I see Jesus Christ for myself, you better have proof to back it up. And I'm not talking about man's proof.